Tell me you don't call Tiago Grandpa. Ah, go. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> How does that go down? Best season. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Boys, first of all, it's great to see you back. Pre-season comes around quickly, doesn't it? How was, how was your summer break, Tony? Yeah, like, uh, it was good. Because compared to last season, like, we just had 10 days off. So, like, these three weeks uh, were very good. And a few weeks to catch up with the family. You're, you're spinning plates, you get your hands full with the youngsters at home, haven't you? Yeah, like, uh, pre-season here and then pre-season at home. <laughs> Which is harder? <laughs> both. Both. <laughs> both, is, both is good work. Absolutely. Kai, as for yourself, a short break after the Euros, how was it to, to get away and reset? Yeah, it was good. It was not uh, too long, but of course uh, the three weeks were very good uh, with the family. But now, of course, we're all uh, happy that we are back now and uh, that uh, the season is beginning soon. Absolutely. Tony, is it too early to talk about the Euros? <laughs> Next question. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, like you said, short break, back in for pre-season. Be honest, is it a time of the year that, that you enjoy? Yeah, like it's, uh, it's a time to suffer a bit and uh, like uh, work hard and get uh, back to for like from where we left. So this is a tough challenge and uh, yeah, everyone starts by zero. Absolutely. Kai, Tony mentioned it there, picking up where you left off. Quite a hard point to pick up from the Champions League final. Has it, has it sunk in how that all played out yet? I think uh, we all dreamed of uh, winning the Champions League one day um, and of course um, now we have to prove it again and again. I think we have uh, all a lot of goals this season. Uh, I think the Champions League uh, title is not enough for, for us all. Uh, we want to win more and I think that's our, that's our aim for the season. We have a very, very good squad. We have good players. I think uh, that's the aim also for the pre-season that everybody uh, will be fit and um, yeah, that we are ready to play. Absolutely. You know that night in Porto made you instant Chelsea legends. How does that make you feel? Tony is Chelsea legends. legends. Both of you? <laughs> like, you don't win a Champions League every season. Yeah, but uh, yeah, it was, it was good. <laughs> 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 it, was, it was good, but uh, legend, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say that. As Kai said, as a team, as a group, and uh, legend, this is uh, what other people decide. But me, me is uh, like... Yeah, we won the Champions League, it's good. Your challenge, the one on Foden, how important was that? I mean, in comparison to, to the goal, the obvious goal from, from Kai as well. It was uh, not only that challenge, it was Aspie's challenge, it was uh, also Reece's challenge, uh, Christensen's challenge and uh, Kai's goal, Mason's assist. Like, it was a good team effort. A phenomenal team effort, Tony, wasn't it? The fans have always loved you and Kai, my goodness. I don't know if you've heard, they've also come up with a song for you already. Are you looking forward to hearing that? I heard about it, so uh, of course I'm happy about it and uh, hope to hear it soon in the stadium. Absolutely. Belinda Carlisle was the original singer. I'm showing my age here. I don't know if you're familiar with her 80s music. Uh, I, when I heard about the song, I didn't know, but then I heard the melody and uh, I heard, I think, uh, the song sometime in the radio, so I know it. Yeah, one to look forward to. Tony, I mentioned the fans there. It's going to be so special, isn't it, playing in front of a full house at the bridge once again? I think uh, Leicester at home. Mm -hmm. I think that was that was kind of that was good uh, atmosphere and uh, the fans were up for it. We were up for it, and uh, so I cannot we cannot we we cannot wait uh, to have all of them back. Absolutely, and Kai, the fans love you. Do you feel more comfortable? Do you feel settled and enjoying life in in England now? It's uh, getting better because also with the fans now in the stadium, they give you a lot of support, um, and yeah, I feel very comfortable. I like it here. I like the city. I like the club. So all good. You're doing well to keep a straight face, he's there trying, trying his best not to laugh at you. Uh, um, I like that though, because we were, it's funny enough, we were speaking to, to Tammy and Christian last week. There is a real special bond, Tony, in this group at the moment, it feels like. Obviously, like with, uh, with success, uh, everything is good and everything, but he is really like, there's a good bond. There's a lot of young players and uh, you have uh, Thiago Silva, who's grandpa. And uh, then you have like to the youngest, I think the youngest is Tino Anjorin. To child, you know, like it's it's a good mix. Tell me you don't call Tiago grandpa. Ah, go. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> How does that go down? Best season. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're a Chelsea legend. You can say what you want. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we spoke about the fans. The supporters guys have been putting their questions to you on the, the fifth stand app, so I'm going to throw a few at you. Uh, Peter S asks, how do you like life in England, Kai, and what hobbies do you have when you're not playing football? So I have a dog, I have a girlfriend here, so I spent uh, um, as many as time as I can with them and um, his yeah. name is Balu. <laughs> apart, <laughs> apart from that, I don't know, just playing football. <laughs> you know what I like? The fact he tells his own jokes and laughs. <laughs>, <laughs> 
Uh, next one I'm going to put to you then, Tony, from Yana, who asks, who has the best fashion sense in the dressing room? Michi Bachwai. Really? Yes. He I likes like, colourful uh, stuff, doesn't he? Yeah, like, uh, it's, you know, like, there's people who have, like, uh, someone, like, who advise them how to dress. But uh, Michi is, like, uh, completely his own vision of styling, so I give it to Michi. Does he still wear his SpongeBob SquarePants stuff as well? Like, yeah, like, you know, all this stuff. <laughs> Final one comes from Sterling. Who is the fastest player at Chelsea? Kai, you've got to be up there. From acceleration, I would say like the first meters, I think uh, maybe Timo, but I think also we have like Tony is very fast, but I think more long distance. Um, but who else? I don't know. I think I would go for Tony and Timo. You know what, Tony? You were nodding there. You're up there as well, aren't you? You're lightning quick. I have my own way of style of running <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but, but yeah like uh, like how we said I think in the first meters is Timo up there but yeah when it comes to longer I think uh, I think it's me final one from me though Tony to you first what does success look like for you this year of course to have uh, have as much silverware at the end of the season how about you Kai yeah the same I think we're here to win trophies and uh, we hope to win as many as we can we look forward to it. Wish you both the luck. Best of luck. Thanks, Thank you very much. Appreciate it.